Hey guys, welcome to the channel. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon. In today's video, I want to show you how to install MX Player for your Fire Stick. MX Player is a video player that you can use with your third party app. So, having said that, grab your remote and let's get started. Okay guys, so MX Player is a really nice video player you can install on your Fire Stick or Android devices. It's usually it's a much better uh, video player than the ones that come with most third party apps. So uh, you can use it for even your home media if you like. If you have any videos on your servers or anything like that, you can use that to view your movies and so on. So the first thing we need to do is from your home screen, go up to your menu, scroll all the way over to the right till you get the settings. Go down, scroll over to the right until you get to My Fire TV, click on that. Go down to Developer Options, click on that. And go down, Highlight Apps from Unknown Sources, click on that. And turn that on. Once you've done that, hit your home button, go back to your home screen. And for this video, I'm going to be using the Downloader app to download MX Player. So I'm going to show you how to get that. So from your menu on the top, go over to your search icon. Go down and start to type in Downloader. And as you can see, usually it'll start, once you type in a few letters, it'll uh, pop up on the bottom. So just go down, highlight it, click on it, click on the icon. And you'll come to this screen and just click download. It will begin to download and install for you. And once you've done that, just click open. And always allow access to your photos and media. So click allow. And click OK on the quick start guide. And once you're in here, just go up into your search box. Hit your center button and type in this URL. M X dot J two I N T E R dot com. And then hit go. And you'll be connected right into the MX Player website. So once you're there with your mouse cursor, go up into the top left where you see your three line hamburger icon there. Click on it. This menu will pop up. Scroll down until you get to download. I, uh, hover over download. Click on it. and you'll come to the download page. So what we're looking for here is if you scroll down for your Fire Stick, you're going to need this version, ARM-V7A. So hover over that with your mouse, click on it. This page will pop up and click on this link right here and it will begin to download for you. Okay, once it's downloaded, Highlight Install, click Install. And once it's installed, click Done. Now we don't need this APK file anymore, so just click Delete and click Delete again. Hit your Home button. Go back to your Home screen. Hit your Home button for two to three seconds. This will pop up, go into your apps, and go down and find MX Player. Click on it, it will open up. And click Allow. And that's basically all you need to do. You don't really need to go inside of this player to use it for third party apps, so we're just going to exit out of this. 
and we'll go back to the home screen okay so I want to show you how to use this with some of your third-party apps so once you're inside uh, your app just go into your settings and you'll see choose default player so click on that and you'll see a list of uh, play available players so just go down highlight MX player and click on it and now you have chosen MX player as your default player so the next thing I want to show you is how to use it while you're watching a movie okay guys so once you're watching your video or your movie or whatever you're watching if you hit your up down button um, you'll see you can change your volume here so I'm gonna hit the center button and hit the pause button so and pause this video for copyright reasons but as you can see you have your usual um, play pause here rewind uh, go back to start fast forward go to the end and over here you will see these four arrows if you click on this you'll uh, be able to change your video zoom here you've got a hundred percent stretch it fit the screen crop uh, we're gonna fit it to screen if you go up into the top far right and hit that three dot icon menu item here you'll see there's another menu display here and if you go down and hit display go down you can also hit the video zoom to this so you can do the exact same th thing through that menu um, also in display you can change your aspect ratio here depending on your monitor your TV screen or whatever device you're uh, running this on so we'll get out of that the next one I wanted to show you is if you go down into tools and you go down into settings click on that you'll see another list of menu items here that uh, you can play around with but the ones you really need to be concerned about would be audio and if you go into audio you can see you have a volume boost here you can uh, click on that or turn it off uh, the other important setting is this audio delay if you click on this it says your where you can sync your audio to your video as as many of you know a lot of times you'll uh, be watching a, a movie or a video and you'll notice that the audio is not in sync with the video so here is a place you can uh, increment it uh, either faster or slower and sync it with your video so it's a nice feature uh, to have there so we're just going to back out of that the next one would be your subtitles so if you click on this you can actually uh, play around with your subtitles and get them the way you want you can change the way the text looks uh, size of the text color of the text um, the subtitle alignments or layout whatever you have um, italic effect uh, so as you can see it gives you a lot more options here so uh, we're just going to exit out and go to the home screen here and as you can see the, you know the reason I wanted to show you this is one many people have been asking me how to install this uh, two it just gives you a lot more options there, it, this MX player is much better than the video players that come with most uh, third-party apps so uh, it will just make your viewing experience that much better guys so I hope you liked uh, this video and I hope you like MX player and if you have liked the video guys don't forget to leave a thumbs up there uh, also uh, subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon and until the next time folks be safe be good and we'll catch you later bye